So y'all say, 10 years don't sleep. 10 years don't sleep. Roots run deep. Roots run deep. 10 years don't sleep. 10 years don't sleep. I said, roots run deep. Roots run deep. Okay, we are here only celebration vibes. All the celebration vibes. <laughs> since we've been able to really like get down and get, like you know get with each other as organizations and people I think a lot of us have spent a lot of time on zoom and you know while that has been a great tool and so helpful for us to move things forward there's quite nothing like face-to-face -face interaction and us being in space and sharing breath and air and you know place together we're here to celebrate a decade of CJA um, growing our power uh, from the local to the national to the international. And we are here to uh, not only exchange ideas, do some level of reflection of where we've been, but more importantly, where we're going. I feel the need to recenter ourselves after 10 years of building this alliance and getting new futures together. So I'm here for the past and I'm here for the future. We're talking about a lot of heavy things. Being able to open up a safe space for people to feel comfortable in brings joy to me, to be honest. Making people feel comfortable, making people feel like they can be their authentic selves. I think that's what it is. And the kids here are bringing joy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Definitely that. All over the nation, all over the world, there's so much resistance work happening and so much effort and energy put into fighting the bad. But in order to build the new world we want to see, we have to do it together. We have to unify. So the convening is a really beautiful opportunity to do that because it brings people from all sorts of backgrounds, walks of life, to come together to share their stories, to share resources and tools and organizing skills so that we can come back, go home back to our communities and keep building the world we want to see. When we come together, we dream bigger. Like we are able to be visionary. We are able to imagine in ways that we couldn't simply alone. We are able to build collective power. As Jimmy Boggs used to remind us, revolutions are made out of love for people and love for place. Love isn't just something you feel, it's something you do every day when you go out and pick the paper and bottles scattered the night before on the corner. When you stop and talk to a neighbor, when you argue passionately for what you believe in with whoever will listen, when you call a friend to see how they're doing, when you write a letter to the newspaper, when you give a speech and give them hell, when you never stop believing that we can all be more than what we are. In other words, love isn't about what we did yesterday. It's about what we do today, tomorrow, and the day after.